Hey guys, welcome back. And today I want to do a brief video on a little problem that occurs with iPhone X and a lot of users are running into it and don't know how to fix it. And I'm referring to the problem where when someone calls you, your ringtone becomes quiet. It's like someone turned down the volume on your phone. All right, let's get into it. So when someone calls you, for example, your ringtone should be loud. As, let me do a test call to myself. So, like that, right? All right. And you see how it just became quiet out of nowhere. I didn't do anything, it just became quiet. Well, check this out. Let me hold the phone up, like this. I'm not doing anything, and let me call again. And let me be looking at my, my phone this time. And you saw how the music went quiet right away when I have it up and it's looking at my face. The face ID is looking at my face and makes the ringtone go quiet. Now there's an easy fix to it and let me show you how to do it. Let me unlock my phone. There you go. So how to get rid of this problem is you go to settings you scroll down, let me pick it up a little bit. You go to face ID and password. And right here, you scroll down where it says attention aware features. True depth camera will check for attention before dimming the display or lowering the volume alert. What that means is when you have this option on, if someone calls you and you are looking at your phone or the face ID is read, uh, looking at your face, it will dim the sound and lower it down. So how to get rid of it is you just click the slider and that's it. So now when someone calls me and let me show you, I'm looking at the phone. As you can see, it doesn't uh, lower the volume and that's the fix to it. Really simple. I know a lot of people had issues with it. Hopefully this helps you guys. And uh, before I go, I wanna do a little poll in my comments. How many people think when you unlock the phone with your face ID, should it take you right away to the home screen without you having to slide up? I think that should be a feature added later in iOS 11, because when you do fingerprint, it takes you to home screen. So why not with a face ID? So give me a comment below. Let me know if you would like that feature coming to iOS 11 sometime soon. And uh, thanks for watching, guys. Like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, and I'll be back with more videos. See ya. Hey, guys. One thing I forgot, I want to show you the case I'm using because I know a lot of people ask me what cases I used in the past when I made videos. So this is a case I found on uh, eBay. The brand is Mickey. It's a leather case. Nice grip around it. Full cutouts for everything. As you could see, cutouts for speakers, charging port, the wireless charging goes through it, and an Apple logo cutout as well. I love this case, feels really well and nice. Um, reminds me of the Apple's leather case, but this case costs only $15, and it's really protective. Unlike Apple's case, they don't have a cutout right here, it's just up to here. This one protects at 360 degrees. I will put a link in the description so you guys could go ahead and check this out. Alright guys, see you next time.